and welcome back to TV on the channel. Hope you're all doing very well. Hope you're having a good Friday night. Uh, sorry there's no stream tonight. I apologise for no stream. I just wanted to take a break of a break tonight. I was all just some streaming really tonight. That's all. Nothing like personal. I just wanted to take a break. So obviously hope you guys come to understand me. Having a break just for tonight. I'll be back tomorrow so don't worry. I'll be back, I'll be back streaming tomorrow so don't worry about that. It's all, uh, it's all good. Um, but I thought I'd do a video today based on something that I've been planning for about three or four weeks now. I didn't mention it a bit ago, obviously, in my community post, I think. Um, so no people in, the, in my, uh, obviously, my channel and stuff that obviously watch my videos and streams have been asking me, like, oh, when's the important video coming up, Lordy, and stuff, and when are you, you going to do it? So I just thought, you know what, I'll do it today. So basically, um, this video is kind of from Markiplier. If you guys don't know who he is, he's a massive YouTuber, he's like, he's, he's like games and stuff, and, um, he did like a video, I think, two or three years ago when he was like, say, for I don't think he was going through hard times in his life, but he just wanted to do a video for his fan base to, I suppose, make him realise like they, they are, obviously they are worth something in life, which obviously everyone is anyway. But in general, though, he, he just like he made a really good video and made some really good points on, you know, how to deal with, with like depression, anxiety, all that stuff. So I thought, you know what, I'll do the same thing today. Um, just to obviously give you guys a bit of different content rather than me playing games stuff on stream and videos. So, hope obviously enjoy it. Um, but say for if you guys are new, say for feel free to subscribe and also like on today's stream. It does obviously mean the world to me. We are on the road to one point, I think three k something. I think if I can remember. Also, ignore the hair. The hair is an absolute travesty. I need a haircut still. It's this bloody lockdown, man. Honestly, I can't even get a haircut at the moment. In time it's uh, it's it's terrible. So uh, yeah, don't uh, don't don't. Put your my hand in the comments down below. Like, oh, what, what is headlines horrendous and stuff? Don't do that. <laughs> um, but anyway, so far into the video. So obviously, when I did my um, announcement, uh, I think about a month ago now, when I was obviously going through a bit of a hard time myself and took a bit of time away from YouTube. Um, obviously, I was so far in a really bad place and stuff, and I didn't like it at all. It was, it was, it was horrible for me to. To even do anything on the day. I didn't want to stream, I didn't want to do a video, I didn't want to get up in the morning, I just want to stay in bed all day and just do f absolutely nothing. I was literally that depressed. I was like, I can't ever do anything. Um, I don't know what it were, just to say, for it's just a mindset sometimes that takes control of you. And you, just, you just can't get um, anything to really give you a certain drive in life to get, in, to, to get up and do something. Like, it was it was that bad. But, you know, I've changed now, back to where we, obviously I should be. Um, so it's like, oh, that's a good thing, that's a good thing, obviously, that's what I want to see. Um, but no, like, if you guys are going through, like, say, four difficult times, there's always going to be people out there back, obviously, you know, you can talk to. Uh, whether it's your parents, whether it's your friends, etc. There's people out there. Don't think you just, you know, you're just alone and voiceless. You can go talk to people about things. If you're a bit scared, then fair enough. But still, that's not the thing. That's not that's not the main thing to do it. If you are, like, generally worried about something, like, you might tell someone something and it might, like, backfire, then, you know, it's better to tell them than you know, not telling. You gotta be honest in the end of the day. That's the best thing I would say to people really. Be, being honest is the best way to be well to being a good person really, being honest. Um otherwise you're just kinda like what's the word? I won't say lying to them, but you're kinda lying to yourself a little bit if you don't obviously tell people or even yourself really stuff that you should be doing really because you know not everyone obviously does come clean and say things that they want to say sometimes. You can always like, you know, throw a little cheeky cheeky like that out of nowhere and get away with it but if you guys are say for going through sort of like stuff like that it's just one of them that you just gotta try and like I suppose deal with um but you know everyone's obviously been put on this planet for a whole um reason really you know everyone's here for a reason whether it's to you know be something in someone's life or whether it's to just do something in general like you are here for a reason guys don't think you're not here for a reason that's why I don't like seeing people in my like my comments in my streams and stuff like that saying like you know the sad and the down. It's not nice seeing that sometimes. Um, that's why I try and like cheer up a little bit just to obviously make them know that they are worth something in my channel, I suppose as well as themselves. So that's always a good thing. Say for you. it's always nice checking on people though. In general though, it's not always um, easy to because obviously you got to try and find time to do it. But if you have the time to do it, then say for it, go make go, go make someone's day. Like literally, it's it's like a two second job. Like, you know, and end of the day, though, like, there are going to be people out there that are going to do you, like, dirty and, you know, be, be fake to you or whatever, but there are general, generally good people out there that can obviously do amazing things for you and can completely impact your life. I've met several people in my, in my life that have, you know, changed my life completely, in good ways and bad ways. Um, you know, I've been I've been down sometimes because of people like that. I've been good because of people like that. You know, it's just, it's just life. Like, life's tough. Um... 
And I don't think anyone obviously tends to really realise that when novices are quite young. I mean, I did it when I was younger, honestly. I didn't really think, I would say, too much about life when I was younger, really. Until I started to grow up a little bit. Like, I would say between, I don't know, the ages of, like, 10 and less, I would say, I didn't really think much about life. I was just, say, for doing the usual that everyone would do, you know, go to school and that would be it. Come home, play on the, on the bloody PS3 back in those days and the... Uh, chill all night and do whatever I wanted to do really but like now when you always see you grow up and stuff and you obviously you don't have to like you know worry about homework and school and stuff like that you just like you, you have to you're like your little bubble really and you have to like try and control yourself because obviously you are like what's the word independent really when you grow up and you got to look after yourself really rather than like, seeing your parents and your other people and your family look it's it's hard you know I've, I've been like on a roller coaster ride, really, for my like journey of being a teen, like it's been something like that continuously. Like it's like a merry-go-round; it just goes in a circle of, of the cycles and stuff. And it's um, you know, but I would say the word to be happy though, boys, is just be patient. Like don't rush anything, don't move too quick on anything. If you guys are always trying to you know move on anything like that, or even girls as well. Um, if you guys are looking for happiness, you will find it one day. Um, you know, it's just it's just time and patience, really. That's all I can really give you on that, really, for like any sort of like advice, really. Um, but you know, it's just how it is. End end of the day, though, like regardless of whatever, you don't need you know you don't need money to be happy. It's nice to always have money in your life, and you definitely don't need people that are gonna be fake for you or toxic. Get rid of those people. You don't even need them, literally. If you have people around you that are toxic, just completely bin them off because otherwise they'll make you just feeling even more shit in your life or they'll actually just try and ruin you completely as a person and personally for me um i've had it before where i've had like i don't want to say it too far it is or anything like that i'm not i'm not i'm not a buddy what they call jake paul person who just completely just call anyone out for, for like for quickly call them something stupid on the internet but i've had people in my life that have obviously done me dirty and it's not really it's not nice obviously but you know it, you just it's just how people are you know you can't you know, you can't change someone's, you know, opinion towards you like, like that in an instant with a click. You can't do that. It's imp it's, it's impossible. It's literally impossible. Um, but, you know, it's just how it is. Um, but don't forget, though, to be fair, if you guys do, like, you know, have a lot of good things in your life, then you, say, for you're spot on for life. You, you're set for life. You've got a good, say, for a good future ahead of you. And, you know, I'm not the best, what's the word, the best motivational talker ever like you know I'm not gonna be you know the best person out there I think people obviously would hate me I'm not gonna be fond of that but I'm not only too bothered though like haters can be haters you know anyone can hate on anybody and whether I've got some or not I don't really think far it doesn't really bother me um it's obviously I've grown up now I'm mature enough now to obviously deal with it like I mean if I was like younger but like oh I can't be bothered someone's upset me whatever I, I don't care I don't care anymore um but you know, I'll say for that. The fact is that I've got a community that have obviously been here for me and obviously, you know, been all the way. It's it was hard I think for me though, personally, when I put out that post obviously for my community thing when I was obviously gone for a week and I saw people obviously saying in the comments saying that obviously they were upset about me and crying about it. I was like, Wow Like I didn't obviously really expect a reaction at all from you guys to be saying that you obviously were crying or feeling upset about me leaving for a little bit like you know it it, it, de it definitely did hurt me a little bit obviously but I was like wow like I generally didn't know people like cared that much for me because obviously I know I'm not like what's the word what's the word the biggest youtuber out there obviously I'm only like a small youtuber still like say for 1000 subs obviously a massive goal but it's not like you know it's nothing like 10k or like 100k clips like that it's nothing compared to that ever but it just shows obviously that, that people still do care for small youtubers and that's obviously great you know that's really really good stuff that obviously people still really care for the small youtubers and obviously trying to get the confidence back in people and stuff and you know that's what kind of i would say motivate me to get back quicker back into my youtube scene really those type of comments you know i saw a lot of obviously that people you know would send love towards me and stuff and it was great to see that you know just obviously people do care for me and you know I care for you guys I do whether I hate you or not I still care for everybody I treat them equally that's the best way about it like you can't just pick favourites like oh I like you but I don't like you I don't like you but I'll pick him instead like you know what I mean I don't do that I don't I don't do that like the best way to do it is for me on my streams or anything in general it just be equal with everybody whether you're a mod or not I still like everyone the same and there's not like say for there's no like what's the word 
um, favoritism, any sort of like that at all, completely, none of it. But you know, it's how it is. It, it's honestly, it's how it is. Um, but don't forget, though, boys. If you are obviously going through difficult times and you just don't know what to do in your life, I say before, just go and talk to someone or do something that you enjoy doing. Whether it's like a hobby, so it's like let's say I don't know, you enjoy doing football, go and get a football from your garage and or whatever, or your back garden, and just go to like a park or like a field and just go play football, or anything in general that, that keeps you happy. Whether it's drawing, whether it's you know. Uh, working out, whether it's you know playing with whatever. If you let's say I don't know if you're a kid play your toys. I don't know. I'm not say I'm not. I don't really know much on it anymore because obviously I've grown up that much. Um, it's hard for me to try and think of things that obviously you know maybe like a young audience but like that would obviously do for a hobby. You know if you get what I mean. Or just play on PlayStation or Xbox. That's a good way to play. I suppose get rid of obviously the bad thing in your mind. But yeah, just try and keep yourself busy though. Um, to try and get rid of those things in your head sometimes it's, it's it's honestly a really good thing to do um but i say for the, i think the biggest thing for everyone though is that people tend to really mention to me whenever they feel down with depression and that's probably one of the biggest ones or anxiety probably as well but i would say depression is probably the biggest one i think i would say personally for me um that i do see quite a lot and it's hard to obviously try and cope with depression obviously it's, it's a it's a really bad thing to have, obviously, you know, it, it, it just ruins you, it, it, it just ruins your whole thing about you, really. Your personality, your appearance, you know, you start, you don't, you don't start caring about your thing anymore, you just don't care how you look anymore. Um, it's it's horrible, and it's it's quite bad, obviously, for, obviously, you know, young people like us, who obviously go through that stuff, and it's not nice, obviously, seeing young people go through depression at such a young age, whether it's, like, you know, 19 or 10 or whatever, like, it's, it's sad. Um, but it happens to the good people though. That's what that's what it is. That's what life does to people. It, it ruins the good people and the bad people always seem to get away with things and don't really seem to get affected as much as obviously the good people. But it's just how it is though. Honestly, it is how it is. Um But just don't give up honestly though, don't give up on it though. Like you'll you'll find a way to obviously try and deal with it at some point. It's just before it's just time and patience. But you know, it's just it is like honestly, it's just what it is. It is just what it is. Um, but yeah, that's why I say before I'm so grateful now. Obviously, when I've grown up now, to be to be more grateful, to be more appreciative of things that obviously people do for me. Like like Stu, like Stu helped me out with obviously my camera. I'm on my PS4 now, like so I can obviously improve my streams. Like what a nice guy. He didn't need to do it, but you know Stu obviously cares a lot. Trying to help me out a little bit and so I thought I didn't ask him for it. He just went. He looked just offered it to me, and I was like appreciate it. I will, uh, you know, I will. Uh, I'll take it off your hands and not let it go any dust, I suppose, in your uh, in your rooms. <laughs> but yeah, honestly though, just much love to Stu for doing that. He didn't need to, he didn't need to do it at all for me, but he just say if I help me out obviously a lot by doing it. And obviously other people as well do, like, you know, on my channel. With obviously raids especially, that's 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 not a good way to obviously, you know, thank people for, for raising your channel. Like I've had raised from many people, I've had, I've had raised from Husty, I've had raised from Eddie, Shane, Stu as always, you know. Toe sometimes if he's obviously streaming, you know. There's obviously there's there's many more to name, but it's just say for it's, it's quite hard to put on a video. You know, obviously you be like just brainstorm, just say for brainstorming just like that, just continuously. It's it's hard to try and think a name. So don't think I've obviously missed your name off of you. If, if if I miss your name, I, I just I still obviously mean everyone, but you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, it's uh, it's one of them. Both of them, um, we can obviously all become eventually happy at some point in their lives where they feel like they are just back to their full potential of being themselves so you know it's just it's uh yeah it's it's quite hard to deal with but it's um it's always worth it though it's worth it though at the end of the day but yeah anyway boys that is me a bit of rambling for a little bit i don't want to say for keep the video too too long to bore you all but i say for if you have got to the end of the video i obviously do appreciate obviously watching the video but hopefully it might give you a bit of advice obviously in the future or just now if you are going through hard times just to, you know, give you a bit of, like, you know, boosting yourself and a bit more, a boost of momentum, whatever, to keep you going, like, you know, you are here for a reason, do they? and you are worth a lot more than you think you are, to people, as well, but you are worth absolutely a lot more to yourself as well, but just say, look, look after yourself, though, and obviously keep, keep yourself focused on yourself, though, that's what I would say mainly, just focus on yourself, don't focus on other people, you can still do that, obviously, but just I would say mainly just focus, just focus on yourself. That's the best way I would say to anyone to do it. Because otherwise, you just kind of just get a bit too distracted with other things. But honestly, though, it's it's a, it's an absolute amazing thing to do. Though it is.
So, uh, yeah. Anyway, boys and uh, people, I will let you guys go. I don't want to say for made, made, made the video too too long. So I know people are like, oh, Lord, he's rambling again. I'm off, in a bit, boom. Like, you know, but hopefully, though, obviously, this video does mean a lot. To say for it is quite an important video, and that's why I should say for I mentioned it a bit ago to be like that. So. Tell you for go. I will uh, see you guys in my stream. Tell you for if you guys are new, feel free to subscribe down below. It's free. Tell you for there's a massive like red button down here somewhere on the screen. Go click it and obviously make sure to turn on your notifications as well for obviously streams and also uh, videos in the future. And also feel free to like today's video as well. There's no like goal, but if you guys would say for appreciate the video, appreciate it as well. So yeah, anyway, boys, I will see you guys in the next stream, which will be tomorrow. And have a great night and peace. <laughs>